Hi guys, in this video tutorial, you will learn how to pass a text box text from one form to the other. So to start, we will create a window form application. Create a new project. And search for window form application. We will put the name to window forms app posting text. Create. Then we will add a new form. We will let it form to add and here we have two forms so let's go to form one and then open the toolbox and here in the toolbox we will search for rich text box and drag it on the form we will center it And then we will customize the form one. So we will change the color. Now we'll change the text of the button and put it to post text. Then we will change the name of the button and put it to btn text. So we'll copy the rich text box and the button from form 1 and put it to form 2. Now let's double click on the form 1 to go to the page load. So here we are in the code behind and here we will have the page load. So on top in the Porsche clause of form 1, we will add public static string text. And then we will assign form 2 the text to the rich text box 1. So the text of form 2 will be assigned to the text box 1. We will put the string to text post. In form 2, I will do the same. So public static string text post form 2. Put the string to text post form 1. And then we will assign the rich text box one the text equal to form two text post form two and in the form load i will add rich text box one the text equal to form one the text post form one so basically what's happening i'm referencing the rich text box to the previous forms text box and now in form 1, we will double click on the button post text. And in the code behind, we will assign text post form 1 equal to rich text box 1 the text. So on click on it, the text box will be assigned to what we have in the rich text box 1 the text. And then form 1 equal to new form 1. Then we will open the form 1. So form one that show correction the form one should be form two. 
because it is form 2 that we should open create a new instance of form 2 then form 2.2 we will open form 2 and we will hide this form that is we will hide form 1 this dot hide Now let's go to form 2 and we will do the same in form 2. So here in form 2 we will change the text post form 2. And in form 2 we will have form 1.2. So when the BTN post is clicked, the form 1 will be shown and the text will be paused. Now let's run it guys. So here we have our form 1. Now let's put a text. Let's put blade programming. Post text. And here as you can see we have form 2 which is open and blade programming is paused. And now let's change the text to this is a test and click on pause. Here we go. Thanks for watching guys. So we have arrived at the end of this video tutorial. And if you like what I do, stay tuned by subscribing. And don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Thank you.